by an evolutionary mindset, if there was a weaker species, a weaker race of people, a weaker gender of people, and the survival of the species meant unaliving that group of people, then evolution would have no problem with that. Okay, fallacy number one is a straw man. Evolution isn't just only the strong survive. It also favors cooperation, reciprocal altruism, and fairness. But more importantly, fallacy two is a major category error. Evolution explains how species change over time, not what we ought to do. Nothing to do with that, and honestly, only people with the most profound lack of understanding of evolution ever make claims like this. It's a huge red flag that they haven't done the work. Just put down your Frank Turek or your Lee Strobel and read just one book on the basics, a children's book, to stop making these kinds of silly, ignorant arguments.